the most common replacement parts for the Jet 17-inch drill press are the table wood insert, the belt, and the chuck. Start by disconnecting your drill press from the power source. To replace the table wood insert, you'll need to remove the old insert. Begin by removing the two wood screws underneath the table. Push up on the block from underneath to remove it. Insert the new block and use a straight edge laid flat across the table to ensure it is level. Tighten the four wing nuts underneath. Lock the block in place with the two wood screws. To replace the chuck, begin by placing a wood block underneath the chuck. Lower the table to clear the chuck area. Lower the quill assembly with the downfeed handles to expose the slot. Lock it in the lowered position. While maintaining the lowered quill position, rotate the spindle by hand to align the slot in the spindle with the slot in the quill. Insert the drift key into the aligned slots and tap lightly. The chuck and arbor assembly should fall from the spindle. To reinstall, slide the arbor up into the spindle. Turn the arbor as you push it until the tang engages the slot in the spindle. Push the chuck onto the arbor. Use a rubber mallet or steel hammer against a block of wood to sharply tap the bottom of the chuck two or three times to seat the chuck arbor assembly. To replace the belts, open the belt cover and loosen the knob. Pull the tensioner away from the belt to release the tension. Remove both belts. Consult the speed chart and position the new belts accordingly to your desired RPM based on the material you're working with. Once the belts are properly seated in the grooves of each pulley, push the tensioner into the belt and tighten the knob. Lastly, close the hood. JET offers a simple way to order all of the replacement parts you might need for your JET 17-inch drill press. You can find replacement parts on our website at jettools.com by clicking on the parts store. If you need any service or repair, one of our 750 authorized service centers located in all 50 states can assist you. Contact our support team today to find a service center near you.